Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So it is late. My cat just went outside and made a lot of noise. It is late Tuesday afternoon and we have no food in our fridge. We usually do our shopping on a Monday afternoon, but we were away on holiday, so it's Tuesday now. So we figured I would take you guys along with me and Ash to the grocery store and show you guys our weekly slash, it's more of a fortnightly shop, actually, hey, shop fortnightly. So mm. show you guys our fortnightly shop and sort of my tactics to getting an affordable, healthy grocery haul. Let's go. All right, so our first rule is don't do the grocery shopping when you're hungry. So we went to sushi, albeit it's not that healthy, but like it could be worse. And we ate some sushi so we're not like starving and we don't buy all the things in Aldi. But then we realized we've got 40 minutes to do this shop. So the trick with avocados is to get one ripe one and two or three unripe ones to put in the fruit bowl with your bananas. Honestly, there like aren't many actually ripe ones, so we'll just get the hard ones and wait for them to ripe. Ripe? Wait for them to ripe? <laughs> wait for them to ripe. <laughs> Right then, yeah. What wait for them to, you said wait for them to ripe. Oops. Um, let's just get one lot of zucchini because I keep getting two and they keep going off. We've got one onions at home. Ooh. Cucumber, good for salads, good for snacking. Um, do you want to get eggplant? No. Never no? Thanks. We were getting four star, but now we're getting three star because the four star is no longer on special. <laughs> I like to get a bulk thing of chicken thigh and then like separate them to get more meals. Chicken thigh is going to keep you full up for longer than chicken breast and it tastes better because it's got like fat I guess. Of course the one herb I want desperately is on here. Um, fresh herbs. Everything tastes better. Like right. he does. So let's get them. Rice. Rice. Look, this may seem excessive, guys, but we get a kilo of hummus every fortnight. <laughs> Do I feel good about it? Yes. Yes. Am I guilty? No. <laughs> get a chunky one, a dip. No. Okay. Really? Actually? Actually. And I like, I polished off the last of it in anticipation of coming today. I know. It's not like, do you just want to get little friends? Yeah. Oh no, I'm like, I found it. Oh my god, Rhea, don't do that. <laughs> I'll get it. Do you just one? You eat it more than me. It's the best. I mean, you can throw too much though. Is literally like hazelnut, cacao, cacao powder, almond oil. That's it, guys. I love that. Peanut butter is great. It's literally just. Oh my god, guys. This is what we love about Aldi. Like, look at the middle section. It's like. Oh, 
episode 50. Christmas present? I see so many people on these shoes there. Yeah. Oh, it kind of looks like Jesus. Have we ever come down this aisle? No. This, this is, is like this all is the chippies junk food. and oh. junk food. <gasps> that is beyond our borders, Clark. Look at this, Riri. Really. Falling baby cups. The cats would literally just like, like ching. Glory. See you later. Yeah. All right, let's this keep moving. We don't have much time. This aisle is beyond our borders. You must never go here. Yeah. That's my biggest tip for trying to shop. Stick to the perimeter. Don't go down the aisles unless you absolutely have to because the whole fresh food is. Yeah. But inside, you just get like this. Mm. Cool bags. Little kittens. Pink because why not? Head to the gluten free section. I like buckwheat pasta. But they, they look, they usually have, no. they usually have buckwheat spirals in stock, but they don't have them. They haven't had them for like weeks. So I'm just gonna get the quinoa henne. I might actually get two of these because these have been fun. Hey, Clucky. These have been a good time. There's Clucky. You gotta check your egos. Individually, one by one. Two packs? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We eat a lot of eggs. They're a good source of protein, a good source of healthy fat. I'm gonna get some frozen fish. Look, if we could afford to get fresh fish from the fishmonger every day, like I would, but I go to uni, people. That's just not something I could do. Where's the bass at? I'm not trying to bass We fucking bass off. Hold on. Looks like we're getting hoagie instead, which is still quite nice, just a bit more expensive. When you're getting frozen fish, you want to get the stuff that's just the fish. You don't want this, because that's not fish. That's like flour and fish and soy and additives. Not that great. Protein bread. There's no protein bread. Like Actually. In a row. Is that everything? I feel like, yeah. I feel like that's go, not enough. Tremendous. Yeah, I feel like we're missing a lot. So baby braids an actual thing. I'm pretty sure we forgot half of our grocery shop. Yeah. Do you have baby brain too? Is it wrapping off on you? Yes, it is. It's yeah, infectious. we look. So we usually spend between two hundred and two hundred and fifty dollars a fortnight on our grocery shop. We shop at Aldi because it's the cheapest and the, it's actually really good quality. But we just left, and this was under $200, and it was like, what, 188 And that's a cheap shop for us for 14 days. So I'm just like, feel like we're going to get to like 11 days in and like be like we have no food left, but that's fine. If we have to come back, we have to come back. But yeah, as you probably saw, our grocery shop is mainly made up just of whole foods, like fresh fruit and vegetables although I will be honest since becoming pregnant like I'm obviously still eating vegetables oh Zarina forgot her hat what an idiot I hope you're watching this see I'm still eating predominantly fruits and vegetables but like I was quite paleo based before I became pregnant but now if I want to eat pasta or I want to eat rice or you know, that kind of thing. I don't beat myself up, I eat it. Um, just kind of eat what I can keep down at this point in time. 